Hey guys, it's King Rebel coming to you guys with another video. So I was minding my business, um, doing some stuff because I want to go on. I told you guys I'm going on vacation this year, right? So I'm making some preparation for my vacation because when I'm out of school, I got some time. So somebody came in my comment and I will read the comment because even though she seemed like she wanted to try and be smart. Okay, sweetie. So she got in my comment. I'm not going to say her at because it's not important. Name's not important, but I did address it, and I will read what she said and what I said. So she got in my comments, and she said, Miss Rebel Rebel, no disrespect towards you, but I'm confused of why you are trying to prove your point about someone else's child. First thing, I'm not trying. I did. What is your message around these videos that you keep posting? What are you going to do to help assist her baby? What do you expect your fans or even her fans to do about it? It's her baby in cap. Exclamation, exclamation, exclamation. She will have to live with her with these alleged issues. Let's pray for the baby that he will be okay instead of constantly talking about it. Remember, this is the internet. I guess she wanted to say this is the internet, but she didn't say that. He has grow and or he will grow and he will see all these, all this mess that's going on. Praying hands. I just don't understand what's your point in capital in all of this. So I responded. As you know, I will respond sometimes. I said, you look like a woman of a particular age. If you don't get it, no disrespect, I cannot help you. But let me address some of your questions. When she had the baby on the internet, it was somebody else. It was somebody else's child then. In, in brackets, hers. No one had no problem then. My post is to show the difference when a parent records their child freely, showing milestones, not staging them. I cannot do anything to assist her baby when she's acting like he's well. She lied and said he was healthy until Blueface posted that he had a hernia. Her fans will keep support and rewarding bad behavior. No one holds her accountable, just makes excuses. You are right. I never said it wasn't her baby, but she chose to expose him to the internet. He had no say-so. It's all for clout and views. We all have to live with what we have done, my love, so that she has to live with it. We all do. Lastly, his parents, the mother and alleged, alleged father, needs to remember he will grow up and see this nonsense they have done worse to that child than people who are trying to shed awareness. The you do not see the point. There is a click off button, a stop button, an exit button on my videos, love. I have not said anything negative. Just show the difference. If you couldn't see that, bless your heart and stay safe. Stay safe. Stay safe. Sorry. So I'm sitting there and I'm like, what is your purpose? You're wondering about what my purpose. What is your purpose? What can I do for a child? That is not in my presence. It's not in a hospital that I work. And I don't even do baby. I don't do neonatals. That's not my specialty. If you've listened to my video, my specialty is psych. My, my specialty is mental health. It's not mom and baby, labor and delivery. None of that. Have I worked in those spaces? Yes. Am I, I, know my, I know my lane. Mental health is my lane. So now you're sitting there talking about what is it going to do. So when... I am sitting here telling you that I've had to deal with a lot of mental illness. And a lot of it come from people don't figure out the partner that they're having children with. Her mom and dad should have figured it out before they got together. People don't sit there and really vet their spouses or their partners. They don't find out, oh, does your mom or your grandma or anybody in your family have blindness, heart problem, diabetes, anything? They just get with people, have children. And then when these people are, when these children are not to meet their requirements, their requirements, they dump them. Or you happy to, because, oh, I'm the clout, I'm the algorithm, I'm this and that. You have your baby on the internet. Oh, everybody care about my baby, bro. Everybody care about my baby. It's a million dollar baby. It's a billion dollar baby. So now everybody's still caring and wondering why the hell you're not caring. But now it's why, why you don't see my point. Point. Lady, go straight to H E hock, double hockey sticks. Because at the end of the day, you guys pick and choose. It's oh, you're talking bad about the baby. Oh, you're dragging the baby. Oh, she has so much hate. When are you guys gonna sit down and realize this all became about because she wanted to go live. She wanted to be infamous. She wanted to stress her clout. This is all because of her. Beyonce didn't have her kids in no hospital and, and aired it. 
Nicki Minaj didn't do it. Cardi B didn't do it. This was her choice. Her life. Her life is the internet. That's where she makes her money. That's why she does stuff so she could go viral. But you guys want to pick and choose. So when her child grows older and run up into a nurse like me or another nurse like th that's in mental health and has to deal with all the shenanigans that they put on the internet, then you want to know uh, why is it my business or why? Why are we talking about it? Because no young girl should be subjected to the stu <sighs> No young girl or grown woman. And I'm sitting there and I'm starting to look at you grown women sideways. And I, I know you don't care. You don't have to. There's The only things you people have to do is stay whatever color you are and die. You don't have to click on this video. You do not have to write me a book. You do not have to write me a thesis. You don't have to write me a scripture about why am I talking about something that is blatant in front of your eyes. Do you guys go on Villad video and write this stuff? Do you go on a white man with the Jew white man, the Jewish white man video and write this stuff? Because it's becoming more adamant that the foolishness is getting out of hand. I post a video where she fed the baby. She didn't cool the food. She didn't blow on it. She just took the food and stuck it in his mouth. Most mashed potatoes are not cold when it's given to you. It's not cold. You want to talk about it? Let's talk about it. I've talked about this before. She didn't even blow on it. She just stuck it on his mouth. While it might be okay for her, it might have been too hot for him. But he didn't jump or anything. He didn't even look at the potato. He didn't look at her hand. He didn't grab it for the plate. He didn't do anything. Anything. Yet you guys want to convince somebody like me that has done assessment for years. For years that I could look at somebody and say, okay, what's going on? And when I do your vitals, I could say, okay, your pulse is saying something, your blood pressure is saying something, whatever, whatever. Or I could look at somebody and be like, you could look in their eyes and say, okay, they're dilated, their pupils are dilated or they're constricted. You could look at certain things and make a certain assessment. Like I said, I don't have to wear, and I wear one. I don't have to wear a stethoscope with oodle noodles behind my name to say that something is off. I'm not a preemie. She, the baby's not a preemie. I've had people come in my comments and say, oh, he's a preemie. Weird. In January, she announced she was pregnant. She had to be in September. Are we really still on this foolishness? You guys will say anything to save her, but you guys can't save her because the same way you guys talking about, oh, what is your point? What is your point? Because some young girl is looking up to her and thinking, oh, if I meet this dude and he has a relationship or he's in a relationship, I could get in that and I will get him because Krishan got blue. Oh, all I have to do is play the fool, look a fool, and he will stay with me. Oh, all I have to do is get pregnant, trap the fool, and he will stay with me. What positivity has she pushed out? What positivity has she pushed out? Let's talk about it. What positivity? What has she shown? She got out of the slums of Baltimore or the hoods of Baltimore to be squatting in a Negro's house that she said exposed her baby peen, that she said done put his hand on her, busted her mouth, that she said done had left her by herself to go sleep with his baby mother, that she said she was with that done had a baby on her that she laughed about putting out his baby's mother then turn around and put her out at eight months pregnant that she said done stole his money was financially abusive physically abusive mentally abusive probably spiritual if she could have remembered that she sat on zeus and smoked reefer smoked a ganja like it was nothing but y'all didn't have no smoke for her then. Y'all want me to worry about her child now when she the person that was carrying it. She the person that was carrying him. She the person that was supposed to love him more than she loved herself and life. Her, the person, the only person that she knows, that knows her heartbeat from the inside, the only baby that she doesn't even know if God will bless her to have another one. And y'all over here telling me, 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 see first data. You are telling me, say me supposed to worry about what I said about proving what point. Ma'am, I had my grandmother to some degree. I had my mother I had my aunts, I had my sisters who stayed on top of me when I had my child at 18, who made sure I slept when I needed to sleep, took the baby when they needed to take the baby. When I came to America and had my kids, I didn't leave my kids with strangers. I didn't leave my kids clubbing. I didn't smoke reefer. I didn't smoke ganja. 
throughout my pregnancy with all four. I wasn't tossing it back in the bowels with all four. I wasn't in the club talking about, oh, this, that, because you wanted to prove a point to, to Blueface. Pregnant and wrong. Loud and wrong. You guys get on this internet and be loud and wrong. I bet you if the doctor come in and assess the baby, you guys will say the doctor is lying too, huh? You guys will say the doctor is lying too. Cut it out. You don't have to like me because you don't know me from a can of paint. Just like I don't have to like Krishan because I don't know her from a can of paint. But what I'm not going to sit there and do and let you guys give push this narrative like, oh, what am I going to do? No, what is she going to do? It's her child. What is she going to do? Keep staging more milestones? She's going to keep staging more milestones? She's going to pretend like she's, oh, everything is all fine and dandy because she's going to have 11 more. You think God is, is going to bless her womb that she'll have more? Do you guys worry about the wrong thing? She should be worried about the right thing. She should be worried about making sure her child is cared for the correct way. Because if God is anything like me, she would have been left with that one and have to care for him for the rest of her life. For what she did to him. And she wouldn't see number 2, 3, 4 to 11, 12 more. She wouldn't see. Until she got that one right. <clears throat> but you guys get in people's comment with this foolishness. Go to DJ Villard's video and say this foolishness. Go to his video because he's making it up too, right? He's making it up too. The platform that our man has. You think he will literally make up stuff about her child? You guys really think he will make up stuff about her child? What you guys going to do? Oh, we're going to report your page. You're going to, because you need to stop talking about our baby. That's not going to change. It doesn't matter if you report 101 pages. It doesn't change what that, that child has to deal with. I posted it on the video. Did you see him blink when she gave him the food? Did you see him grab for the food? Did you see him grab her hand? Did you see him grab for more food? Did he do anything that that baby would do that she said the baby was hungry? Did you see he, him do anything? She's the type of person, you all are the type of people that she could take shit and paste it in your face and you say it's peanuts butter. She's the type of person that can take poop, wipe it in your face and say it's peanuts butter. Because y'all seen it with your own eyes but coming up here with this foolishness. I wasn't born at night and I'm not new to this, I'm true to this. This is not on, only on my resume, it's in my DNA. I'm good at what I do. And if there's anybody that's going to sit there and prove that that baby is not delayed, then prove it. You guys, the same little video that we get, y'all be talking about, oh, I've seen him, I, I've seen him in a walker, stuffed up, propped up, staged up. Look at the video I posted. Look at the video I posted. That is a video taken from a distance, right? Uh, enough distance that you could see. When have she posted one sitting back with the baby playing on the floor? And her just recording from the sofa or from from the floor, uh, live, um, vertical from him. When has she posted any of those? When has she posted him fighting to tear the food apart because he's tearing it up? When has she posted that she's been making food from scratch, boiling some um, some some potato or boiling some eggs or boiling some oatmeal or boiling some banana or whatever? Not boiling, but processing it. What has she showed that she's made real food for that baby? When has she showed he's on the chair, banging, ready to eat, and fighting the spoon and grabbing the spoon? When has she shown that? When has she shown him, she, he sees his bottle and just eh, 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 and trying to grab for his bottle? When has she shown that? When has she shown it? Oh, it's not our business now, right? But we had to be in the room while she, we had to be on the internet while she yelled about, take this little N-word out of me. Y'all forget that part, right? While she was jeweled up, nailed up, and made up to go have a baby. But now it's poor. The baby will see. You think he won't see when his dad said, I have no connection to that baby? You think that he won't see, well, alleged dad, you think he won't see when she said, oh, I could abort the baby tomorrow. I don't care. You, you think he won't see when she's like, oh, I should have an abortion. Oh, so us saying the mama ain't ish is the problem. It's not what came out of the mother and the alleged father's mouth that's the problem. I see, dummy. It makes no sense the stuff that you guys say on this internet. And I'm scared for the world because some of you people literally have jobs and work in corporate America. Some of you nurses as well be saying that foolishness. And I'll be looking at y'all sideways like, 
Yeah. All y'all hoes needs is a Stanley cup and a stethoscope, and you got it, babe. You got it. That's not what nursing is. Just like everything is, is in you, not on you. A lot of you stuff, be, a lot of y'all be wearing this on you and taking it off. And pick and choose when you want to take it off. That girl had an opportunity to turn her life around and made the difference for her family. But she was so selfish and so self-centered and arrogant and full of crap. That she got saved out of a situation and she didn't know what to do with it. She got put out. She got put out in. She got put in a situation. She had Kiki Palmer. She had all these people trying to help her. Yendi, but what she did, act like she's better than. But see, that man upstairs will humble her in time because the higher you, the higher you go, the harder you fall. The higher you go, the harder you fall, and that's why Puffy is dealing with that now. See, he went far. He went high. So his his fall is heavier. His fall is heavier. But what is my point? Am I going to assist her? Why isn't Papa Smurf assisting her? Oh, no. He's assisting her making milestone that never happened. Why isn't Marsha assisting her? Oh, yeah, that's her doormat. My bad. I thought it was her friend. It's her doormat. Why isn't Jay assisting her? Oh, that's her yes man. Do you know who's assisting her? Smiley. You know who's assisting her? The, the dope man, allegedly. <clears throat> You know who's assisting her? Henny C. Henny on rocks with a chaser of Red Bull or Gatorade. You know who's assisting her? The ganja man, ganja farmer. That's who's assisting her. I posted a while ago where they said, oh, the baby smell like the, 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 her dope dudes. Allegedly said the baby smell like a weed. And I, when I first saw it, I said, you know what? I believe it. The girl looked like she's musty, dusty, and rusty. <clears throat> and when people are like, blue face, blue face, yeah, blue face look like he nice, to, he like nasty vagina. I've met a few men in my time that I've hang with because I hang with dudes more than I hang with females. I ain't never met a dude said he likes stinking vagina or sweaty, wetty, nasty vagina or a girl that don't bathe for three days. I've never met a dude. So that speaks a lot about blue. And that speaks a lot about Carlissa because that's how she raised him. My son will get up at 6. He take his shower before he go to work. Musty vagina. Please. Have y'all ever pissed and didn't have wipes and you know, and you didn't drink enough water? You know what you smell like? And I know because I have to deal with a lot of people. You know how people smell when they don't drink a lot of water and they piss me strong, rank, yellow to the point they brung? Messing up their bladder. <clears throat> and you telling me that that is sex appeal? That is just nasty. You saw the baby. She posted the baby. The baby had dirt all around the neck. And if she don't wash her pum pum right, you know she ain't washing the little boy right. The young one. Oh, he love her. Oh, don't give a goddamn. He a nasty Negro. He nasty. He nasty. And she is too. Because I've seen some mothers that don't know and they learn, they got up and they got it. Like I said, I've met mothers that know more about their child's disorder, their plan of care, their treatment more than the doctors. Talk to me nice. I've met parents, family, grandparents that have taken care of their grandkids or they've taken care of their children or had to step in that know more about their children's care or their daughter or granddaughter or the baby they took over care than the doctor but you want to sit here and tell me the sad part I listened to a lot of people said she might have cerebral palsy before I was a LVN I took care of a baby that had cerebral palsy that passed away on her birthday three years old there's stuff that I could really talk if I wanted to pop it that's why I said it many times you know what stuff I could expose but I don't but you're not going to come in here and make it seem like I don't know what I'm talking about because you want to say oh it's a two second clip oh what is her child oh her child's going to see she, the child's going to see what the mama called the baby this little n word and it's going to hear what I said and that's okay and I'm supposed to feel bad because you were not even out her woman she called you a little n word many times you were not out of her woman. She said she could abort you so many times, but us putting an awareness that your mama ain't shit is going to affect him how. That the father said, no, that's not my baby. That's Charles Barkley, baby. That's K. Suave, baby. That's the neighbor's baby. That's, that's, so 
I'm going to affect the stuff that I'm posting that's showing how a baby's supposed to function, how they're supposed to meet their milestone. Somebody tell, what? Delisa came in my comment talking about, I have 50. What lie did Delisa say? Because Delisa be lying. Delisa going to go to hell. I know the Lord is tired of her. <clears throat> she said, why y'all, <clears throat> why, excuse me, why y'all worried about rock baby? I have 20 grandkids. Some, some did things slower than others. However, there's nothing wrong with none of my grandkids junior just spoiled just saying girl if you don't go to hell with that bullshit you always got something to say nobody like your foolishness because you some <clears throat> some of y'all make me think that women that's why they don't give women power and i've never believed that women should have power some of y'all be confirming that for me because some of the stuff that y'all be saying and i said some of y'all so don't come in my comment talking about some of y'all you have 20 grandkids and you slower than a snail. So you mean to tell me all your grandkids wasn't holding their bottle at nine months? None of them was sitting up. Girl, if you don't go to hell, I know God tired of you. He tired of you like I tired of you. With your lying ass. Just say anything. She's not going to like you. She's not going to shout you out. She'll laugh if y'all defend her because she can't defend herself because she's slow as a, she's slow as a rock. No pun intended. <clears throat> Don't come in my comments talking no foolishness like I care what you're saying. Like I said, this is not only on my resume, it's on my DNA. I don't take this shit off. It's in me. I've been polite and I've been nice with a lot of stuff I've said from what I haven't said. Because I don't have to. Because time will tell. And her time is coming. And that's why you'll see she'll probably start to post him less and less as she should have been in the first place. I'm big on that. I'm big on that. Let your child be a child. What are you posting him for? Because you can't go viral with your shenanigans? Go viral with your shenanigans and blue shenanigans. It's the foolishness that you guys uphold that I don't get. <clears throat> it's the foolishness that you guys uphold that I don't get. And you guys are the same ones that will have kids that will let your kids do what blue do to a girl like her. Because at the end of the day, that girl was that girl had mental illness a long time ago. She had to. She had to. It's not just China. She had to. I will say allegedly, but ain't no way. I ain't never met a slower female than it in my lifetime. And I've met a lot. I've met a lot. The stories that I've come across and the stories that I've been through, you guys, will make some of you guys fall to your knees. So don't sit here and give me the pity party for her. When I've had to sit down and listen to people, how they had to, when they have been gone through essay from family member to family member to family member, when unalignment is the only thing they know. When they've gone through, if this wasn't that, it was drugs. When I had to start stood there with somebody with drugs, with trial, going through it because of what they went through when they're younger. Don't sit here and tell me anything about having pity for somebody that got out of it. Left the dude. God, you left him when you were pregnant or he put you out. God even got did you a big one and put him in prison, not prison, in jail for six months. And you still out here acting like a fool. Then she deserve everything she get. Unfortunately, the baby is next to her. So he will reap what his mother sow. Or you will sow what you reap. <clears throat> Unfortunately. It, we, karma don't pick and choose. It just go to the address. You think this baby is not a karma for all the bad things she's done? You're going to sit there and think that, oh, Krishan just going to go through life easy. Like I said, while y'all saying all that, y'all better pray that God didn't give her this one. And she won't be able to have a, a 2, 3, or 4 to the 11, 12. And she will be stuck taking care of this baby for the rest of her life. Because Blueface is not going to do it. He's going to help as much as he's not going to. He's going to be around for some cooch. But to take care of a baby, he didn't take care of Journey. He watch her a little bit. You see him when he puts her on live. When Jaden probably go do her run. <clears throat> but what is he going to do with a baby that not that he has to hold? And he can't give. He has to hold the bottle. He can't give it the bottle to hold. He can't put it to sit up. He has to hold it or chuck it up on a pillow. And I keep saying it because that's all came in my mind. <clears throat> but you guys get the picture. So all this. Oh, what are you talking about her baby for? When are you talking? What is he going to help her baby? No, ma'am. Go ask her why don't she help her baby. Go ask her why people have called CPS and it's being blocked because she's over there not answering the door. Don't ask me. Ask her why she's not answering the door for CPS. If her baby's 
healthy and fine. Why doesn't she answer the door? See y'all asking the wrong question to the wrong person. Ask her why she not answering the door when CPS go to the door, to go to the house. Ask her why she answered the house, the, the 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 house when anybody go knock up the house that she doesn't know. Stop asking me silly questions because at the end of the day, it was never about the child. It was about the neglect of the mother that poured down on the child. Have that conversation. She's a weirdo and she's always been one. But y'all want to applaud it? Why? Because she's black? A lot of you guys are on this nonsense because of skin. Okay. What has Christian done for her mother? What has she done for her family? Oh, she took PD everywhere she goes and she took care of PD. Is that right? <clears throat> Is that right? Right now she has a big ch- charity to stay on her best side because as long as they're not missing Tifa, she good. Make it make sense. Anyways, I just wanted to discuss that. Stop telling me foolishness. Because it's go, always going to be bless your heart. You know why? Because for me, that's funny. Like, bless your heart to me is like a smart, smooth insult. Like, poor thing. Oh, oh, boo-boo. Oh, wow. You are too old to be this slow. But I'll see you guys in the next comment. Till next time. And Elisa, go put your comment on Rock's page. Go put it on her Snapchat or on her YouTube or on her um, what is it? Her Instagram. She would appreciate it because I don't. You be saying anything? I swear to. I'm so glad I had the parents I had, because a lot of y'all are embarrassing as parents. Y'all are embarrassing as caregivers. Y'all are embarrassing, and that's why I said a lot of y'all will sit and say, oh, "I'm a nurse or this." Mm. Yeah, your stethoscope again and a and a study in the company. You think you got it, babe? Anyway, again, till next time. Peace. Believing show. This isn't. This isn't the first time. Believing show. This isn't. This isn't the first time. Blueface made this post on his story saying how he put Rock out for Jaden. So, y'all, the tweets are tweeting. Now, Blueface tweets house clean, laundry done, breakfast ready. This more my speed. That was definitely a shot at Krishan because a few months ago, Blueface had put Krishan on blast for not doing laundry for over a month. Now, lately, Krishan has been very quiet, but she did respond. She tweets, what's more my speed is putting my money in my own bank account instead of an ungrateful beep beep account telling me every day I don't have money when I make money. I stopped listening to a manipulator and stopped making excuses for him and started choosing Krishan. Now Krishan also goes to tweet, I was drunk my whole time with him and it wasn't because I love to drink. It was something I needed. So I'm straight around that energy. Then, when all of a sudden I couldn't drink no more, I honestly couldn't be around him no more. I couldn't be around somebody like that for too long. Sheesh. So Blueface goes ahead and blames the alcoholism on her family history. But it's his last tweet for me acting like he don't know what's going on. He says, just relax, focus on yourself, keep getting your money. Have your baby, you blessed, you don't owe nobody none. What's the matter now? All right, y'all. We're gonna have the big baby shower. <laughs> Aww. So, yeah, pray for me with that. And yeah, we're gonna do this also to our whole Philly. It's three heartbeats. Really gonna have love forever. Maybe I do need to abort the baby and just work with myself. Oh, yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm gonna be attached to somebody that really don't know how to love forever. Maybe I do need to abort the baby and just work with myself. Oh, yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm going to be attached to somebody that really don't know how to love forever. He has black folks out here doing. It's unfortunate because it's it's a stigma and a stereotype that, that, that we live into, live up to. Yeah. That's where they set the bar, you know what I mean? That's what, unfortunately, what, that's what reality TV has black folks out here doing. Months ago, there was some diehard Krishan fans that tried to make it seem like I was the one who was in the wrong. And she wasn't just drinking while pregnant, she was also smoking. It got to the point where I had a whole debate with a brain-dead Krishan fan, and she tried to justify saying that 
while pregnant was okay. That's how you know she has diehard fans because nobody said anything about this at all. Sean fans think that she does no wrong when in reality they're both very much dysfunctional. And the reason why they're having talks about this right now is because fans are speculating that Krishan's baby has fetal alcohol syndrome or something like that. Now, this is not a diagnosis. This is just what people have been saying on the internet, not me. That's just what the internet is saying, man. That baby's having to go through the most. He spawned in with all the trials and tribulations. What do y'all think, fact or cap? In my opinion, it might just be a fact. Okay. Where the bottle at? Yeah, oh my gosh! Drink it. She asked for Thank another you. bottle. I'm just. Can you get a liquor? Yes, I can. I can abort the child tomorrow. It won't hurt me. Nah, you should do it because it's cold. No liquor. You don't want to have a kid. I don't want to have a kid. I got my passport, my license. I'm about to get the fuck up out of here. Fuck you, boy. Where you going? To another country. You still can't have a baby in this country. Start a new life. No. So right. Why do you feel like you need to leave? It's nice. What? We changed the subject. Oh, word. Change it. Yeah. Let's talk about... Yeah, no, no. The important part. Because you're not... We're not Show doing it. We don't that. believe in it. Come on, we're not I have six, it. and you That's know That's some cornball shit. You know, we're not corny. We're not having a baby.